Hello everyone, my name is Christian Negulescu and today I will show you how to start a marketing cloud automation with UiPath. So first from the UiPath Go, you download the marketing Salesforce Marketing Cloud um, connector. Yeah? Then you'll have the, your marketing cloud uh, instance. If you don't have UiPath, you will go to uipath.com, go to start trial and uh, then you'll download the community edition and work with the for free with the community edition now let's see what you need to configure so after we install the uipath studio a new uipath studio will create a, pro a new process yeah we'll call mc cloud for marketing cloud to be able to install the package you will go here on the manage package and you will select all packages, then you will write Salesforce. Salesforce. There are a lot of packages with Salesforce, but today we'll talk about marketing cloud activity. Good. Let's install this marketing cloud. Hit save. And under uh, under UAPAT um, team, you will see that you will have this Salesforce marketing cloud activity. You have around 25, 30 activities here that allow you to work with subscriber, SMS list, import data, emails, the data extension, and so on. But today we'll talk about the connection. So you'll drag and drop the Salesforce Marketing Cloud Application Scope. And here on the application scope, you need to configure the connection. So you need to configure the customer key, customer secret, uh, and subdomain. Let's understand from where you take this data. So. If we we'll go back to uh, um, Marketing Cloud here, if we we'll go back to Marketing Cloud, first you need to go to Setup, yeah? So I will go here on the Setup, and then I will go to Application in Setup. Now on Application, I will go to Install Packages, yeah? Let's wait to load. Here I will go to New, I will put a name, Test. Yeah. And here I will, so now we add component. We say API integration. We say server to server. Okay. And then we have to select what, uh, uh, what we need to allow to do. But we'll do this based on the limitation that we have here. So we do email lists, SMS subscribers, and so on. Uh, after I will click next, the, uh, so after I will go and uh, click next here, the system will provide me a lot of ID from my instance. And from uh, that ID, I will take the um, client, uh, customer key and customer secret and put it here. And then I can test the connection. For the subdomain, it's basically, uh, I will show you exactly what it is. Okay, so the URL, basically it's, um, on the authentication, it's all this stuff before. So I match, I, I um, uh, put uh, different numbers on my URL to don't know the, to not know the, the real one. So everything before authentication marketing cloud, it's your URL that you'll put there. And then after you put there, you are able to go here and you have everything and you can test the, uh, the connection. Okay. Good, so remember, if you want to see other movies with um, Salesforce, ServiceNow, NetSuite, Zendesk, Jira, Confluence, and other implementation, please follow me on the YouTube on Christian Negulescu. Bye-bye, have a good one.